So this is where we've been staying. This is one of the regular deluxe cabins right here. So this is one of your cheaper options if you, uh, you know, like some place to stay. So this is what this looks like. Got a big queen over here, central air thinger, sidewall, two bunks, but the mattress pads are just an absolute joke. <laughs> Ladder's a little sketchy getting up here. We have a kitchen-ish area, microwave and small fridge. And then over here is the bathroom. So yeah, the regular deluxe does not have a sink in the bathroom, but the new deluxe does. So if you like little mini shower things and, you know, it works, I guess. <laughs> but oh man, that, that cottage is gonna be one hell of an upgrade. And in case you're curious what the new Deluxe looks like, we've got one massive bed over here. Got a little sink, a little refrigerator, a little microwave. Comes with a Nikon. Yeah, fancy one of them thingers. I actually got a sink in the bathroom with a big-ish shower. Turtle trees. Oh, and you're gonna like the, uh, the bunks over here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at least it comes with an actual ladder, but yikes. Tight squeezy. So this is the cottage. Got a whole freaking bedroom over here. This stuff. Got a closet. Central air. All that kind of good stuff. Fancy. Got a bathroom over here. Real cabinets and stuff. Oh my god, a full friggin' shower. Look at that. A little tiny thing to get stuck in. More drawers and stuff. Very nice, very nice. A full fridge. Oh, <laughs> oh buddy. That is freaking dandy. Cool. Look at this. Sink. Whole range. Coffee maker. Microwave, got a little dining room area over here, the TV, couch, double bunk, but they're real Serta mattresses. They're not some like quarter inch thick foam th excuse. Cool. Yeah, and this is only $25 more a day. <laughs> it's really gonna be here two more days, totally worth it. Alright, so here we are at uh, the next thing. I think this is some creek or fish. <laughs> Something. Are you winking at me, mister? Talk of the video. What are those headlights? Um, where are we going? That way. Yeah, yeah but what, what's this place called? I mean, I know we're on Mill Hidden Canyon, Canyon, but. Hidden Canyon. Hidden Canyon? Cool. I'm gonna see if we can find the Hidden Canyon.
caught me off guard. Holy shit. Hey, yeah. Uh, not gonna lie, coming around that one bend, that rock really snuck up on me. I thought it was gonna roll for a second. Yeah, it's, it was a bit more stable on that. Breaking a friggin' weak old pretzel over here. I got the bridge. I'm gonna smash with the rock, I guess. Yeah, let's see how uh, durable they are. It's gonna break the fucking rock in that. <laughs> let's do a science experiment. Let's test the hardness level of a weak old pretzel. Oh. Now you can eat it. <laughs> I dare you. Finally got to the delectable center. Triple bulldog bear. Oof. It's kind of fitting, it's dough. It's still fitting. <laughs> <laughs> now you mix it with water and it gives it taste. <laughs> <laughs> it's a long boat.
Put it in four low reverse and just floor it. What's up, dude? Let's go, man. Yeah. 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 Hi. Bruh. Sausage, egg, and cheese bundle. As a wise man once said, this shit slaps. saying crystal geyser anymore it's saying secret spire so after some gps coordinates we figured out yeah we're a little far away oh well more time to rip in the sandy eh? yeah
Holy shit. Well, this guy. Yeah, Tina's out. got the hat. He's got the fucking the man bun over here. I probably look like fucking shit right now. <laughs> your hair actually looks alright. But you keep brushing your fucking hair. Yeah, yeah. Gotta yeah, keep it clean. I like caught up with Every the taco. Time he stops, I see this. Yeah. There we go, found it to crystal guys. No, it looks like it's uh, expanded metal across the top. Yeah, it's it's down. Down. Let's see if you can get it. This one. How do you use a razor when you're out of gas? Isn't that bad for the belt? I don't know. Is it in neutral? Yeah. Then you're good. <laughs> Dude, we could have four wheel drive, baby. Shot out. Get out of the way,
sounds so sm When your buddy asks you how much harder to send it, give him an honest answer. We found a cable. Oh. Woo. Well, I don't see a panel, so I don't think we lost a panel. Unless it's under the sand. But yeah, I think we definitely landed on the uh, the axle skid. We hit like the hardest portion of sand you can find. Yeah. Oh man, that thing. Woo. Yeah. Oh. Just for. Oh, it's so hard over here. Holy shit. Yeah, this is like rock hard sand we had to fucking land on. Oh. Ah. God, my lower back is fucking killing me, bud. Whew. Okay. Don't think it broke anything, though, so that's nice. Oh. Ah. Don't jump a can am. Don't jump a can am. There you go. See? That's a nice gentle. 45, size 13. 40, 45 feet. Woo. 45 feet. In the distance. That was all in the air. What the fuck? Oh, never again. Never again. It did, it might have died. Oh my god. Yeah. Your back in the well, that's what Tina's pictures are for, eh? Yeah, true. Oh, I got that was your laptop. It's almost bittersweet saying goodbye to the Can Am, especially with this guy having a look at it all day, but you know, sometimes you just gotta let go of the things you love before they kill you. Bit of a thirsty bitch, too. She takes 91. Bastard. Okay, cool. And so ends our adventure from Full Sense Day. Thanks, High Point Hummer. You guys are awesome. Two solenoids. This one lets air in, that one lets air out. Okay. And then after a while, it stops and checks the rate of airflow. That's a fancy looking chip. Jesus, what the fuck does that drive? Everything? Huh. I don't know. You have two solenoids and a pressure sensor, and then the rest of it's coating. Neat. Check the, check the initial pressure, let some air out, 
check the pressure again, see what the airflow is, do some calculations, let more air out. Yeah. Well, we're all loaded up. Finally time to send her home. Till next time, Moab. Till next time. There's a bunch of skydivers. Oh. I don't even see them. Probably not, they probably just look like little... It's bitty thingies. Not the ones on the road. Not for long. <laughs> Turn him into grape jelly. You can do anything in freaking Moab, man. Yeah, there's tons of them. Well, it's like a skydiving. I haven't, and I don't know if I ever would. I would. But I'd be more likely to use a squirrel suit. Script. <laughs> Honestly, I'm being serious. I want to do it so fucking bad. The only nice thing is, if your parachute fails, you have the rest of your life to think. <laughs> well, with the squirrel suit, you have a parachute. So if the, the squirrel suit fails, you have a parachute. The, the wing suit? Uh, wing suit? shit all over the place, man. Utah, man. I wonder if it's